Maine's hospitality businesses took center stage today in Portland as hotels and restaurants were able to meet face to face with suppliers for the first time in three years. New Center Maine's David Guildford dropped by for an update on this hard hit industry as a welcomed tourism season approaches. This is my competition. Alyssa Maziars is passionate about her job. I love people. She's a supervisor at a Portland hotel and decided to have fun with some of her peers. Do I have to do it with one hand? At the main lodging and restaurant expo in Portland. <laughs> Anyone who wanted could compete in a so-called hospitality hustle. Maisie Ars is hustling through SMCC's hospitality management program with an eye on a career. Given the pandemic, there's so much potential, not just for myself, but for anybody who's looking for a job in this industry. The workforce of Maine's hospitality industry stole the show, but Wednesday's expo connected restaurants and hotels with suppliers, a much welcomed in-person connection after two years away. It's really, really nice. With summer tourism approaching, Hospitality Maine President Matt Lewis is excited about an industry rebound. But also on his mind, earlier this month, Congress dropped further restaurant relief from its latest spending bill. Despite the talk of how busy Maine will be this summer, there still are businesses next door to us that are really fighting tooth and nail to stay afloat. Some businesses are seeking financial help, while many others still need workers. According to the National Restaurant Association, we are 7,800 jobs behind in hospitality than what we were prior to the pandemic for the state of Maine. There is still much ground to regain for Maine businesses. Thankfully, busy months lie ahead. Enjoy. In Portland, David Guilford, New Center, Maine.